Hi everybody, this is Donnie Vaughn of the Marketing Twins. This is a updated video on how to set up a Facebook fan page. And this can be done for a business, an organization, such as maybe a nonprofit organization, or possibly even a church. Let me show you how to do this. Now this is in the summer of 2010. Uh, after Facebook has recently rolled out some new changes to its pages. Um, so I'm going to show you that. And there's a couple different ways to do it. One, you can start, go to Facebook.com. Go down here to create a page. And if you go to that, you'll be taken directly to this page here. Now, this page will show you some things related to community pages, which we won't spend the time today talking about. This is where you can create a page. And we'll spend our time talking about that today. There's also a group. If you would like to create a Facebook group, which is great for smaller organizations, uh, maybe a, a, a church wants to set up a group of volunteers so that you can communicate more intimately with the group. Um, those are different ways. That you have a certain cause that you want to set up, Facebook group. But if you have a business, a, a nonprofit organization, or a church and you want to set that up, this is where you'll go. Now, the other way to do it is if you sign in to Facebook, and I'll go ahead and sign in. You once you've gone to once you've signed in, you'll be brought to your news feed. I can go to any page that I want that I'm already a fan of, and I'm going to select our Marketing Twins fan page, which is here. And if I scroll down to the very bottom, there's a create a page for my business. That's another way of getting to this same page. So those are a couple different ways that you get there. Now, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to create a new one. Um, we're going to call it a local business. I'm going to select what type of local business. And for this, I'm going to call it a professional service. Now, I'm going to go ahead and create one called 1429 Creative, which is another branch of our Marketing Twins organization. 1429 Creative can be used for church marketing and communications. I'm going to note that I'm an official representative and I simply create the official page and it takes that many steps and I've got a page is now being created. So now I just have to create some, uh, some different content on the page. I can, I would like to go in and put some more info by editing that. I can also change and upload a picture here, which I'll go ahead and do. And, uh, here in a little while I can put a new picture on there. Once I've loaded the picture, that'll also a place to put a thumbnail that you'll use anytime you put wall post out. Um, you have a little thumbnail right next to you. Uh, so that's what you would want to do is to create that picture, create the thumbnail from that. And you've got your page created. And at this point, you'd also want to write something, a description here. You can then suggest this page to your friends. You can also add and customize. Uh, I'm going to say you go ahead and add in the events. If you want to add in possibly, um, let's say, a photos. But you can also do some customization. And I'm going to go to show you real quickly what I'm talking about. I'm going to go to our Marketing Twins page. So if you're not a fan of the Marketing Twins, please feel free to be a fan. You can go to Facebook.com slash Marketing Twins to become a fan. Now, if you are not a fan, you're going to be taken to our welcome page. It's our custom landing tab. You can see how we've customized this with a great image. There's a video that can play right here. You can actually click here to get a free gift. Click here to reach us. Click here to start your customized fan page, which we can help people with. You can also get to our website. There's another tab related to customizing your page. And the image comes up and it basically shows a gallery. You can click on this. And there's our Flickr gallery that plays. Uh, you can also create a uh, customized fan page by creating a link over here and then having our uh, email marketing eye contact information right here so people can sign up. So those are some good examples of some things that you could do. Uh, we would encourage you to customize your fan page. We believe in making your fan page stand out, be remarkable. And one of the ways that you can do that is to customize it. The other thing you could do with the profile picture is to customize this at a much larger size than what most people do, uh, you can actually create this. And we can help you do that. And you can see here that this image here, this part of our uh, profile image, is actually what makes up our thumbnail image right here. But you can see we have a lot more canvas space than just a small little square, which most people typically use. But we can put a lot more information on here and even list our website, etc. So that's a little bit about how to create a fan page. 
and then also some special things that you can do to customize that. If you need help with any of that, please feel free to visit us at marketingtwins.com. Thanks.